In this video, we will discuss what is a calibration, the calibration process in pharmaceutical industry, calibration frequency, ISO standard for calibration, and pharma calibrator. Hi guys, welcome to my channel with another video. In this video, we will discuss about the calibration process in the pharmaceutical industry. We will learn what is a calibration. What is a calibration procedure in pharma industry? What is a calibration frequency? What is calibration standard for ISO? And in the last, what is a pharma calibrator? So let's start. So what is a calibration? Calibration is a process to verify the output of a measuring instrument against standard reference values. The output of a measuring instrument is compared with an instrument or device which, which has its output verified. Calibration helps in identifying faulty instruments because during normal processes, it is difficult to classify the faulty instrument from the correct ones. If the output of the measuring instrument follows standard reference values, calibration is successful and the instrument can be used for measuring relevant variables. It is considered that the output of the instrument is reliable and can be safely used in any process. If the output of the measuring instrument is, does not follow the standard reference value, calibration fails. The output of failed calibration is, instrument is not re reliable and any process in which it is used is not considered safe. The instrument whose calibration is not successful should be rectified or removed. After rectification, calibration must again be performed. If it becomes successful, only then the instrument is allowed to measure process variables. Similarly, if the instrument needs to be replaced, it must also be calibrated before new installation. Only after successful calibration, it is allowed in a process. Let's discuss calibration in the pharma industry and see how it plays an important role in keeping the manufacturing process in its specified limit and prevents deviation in the specification of the output product. Calibration is used along with other quality improvement techniques. It keeps the output of a measuring instrument within its acceptable limit by detecting uncertainty in the instrument output. Detecting uncertain instruments enable maintenance personnel to remove the defect. If it is not possible to remove the defect, the defective instrument is immediately replaced with an instrument having a certain output. Instrument having certain output specifications helps in effective pharma processes by accurately measuring different physical variables. For example, a calibrated temperature sensor accurately records temperature values which will then be used by a main controller to execute a pharma process. Additionally, other reasons for calibration includes Calibration is a maintenance technique. It effectively points out instruments that require maintenance. Maintenance personnel use calibration to verify the output of an instrument and see either it is working accurately or not. Calibration is a regu regulatory requirement. Regulatory and standard, standardized, standardization bodies such as the United States FDA and the International Organization for Standardization requires pharma manufacturers to regularly calibrate measuring instruments and devices. These bodies inspect the status of instrument during their routine inspection. If they find out any discrepancy or shortcoming in calibration process, they can issue a warning to the pharmaceutical manufacturer. Calibration also helps in accurately executing critical processes. If a measuring device is properly calibrated, 
a pharma process using the instrument will accurately deliver the desired results. For example, calibrated instruments in a filling machine accurately fill the pharma product in a filling container. Calibration helps in detecting faulty instruments. In a pharma production process, chemical compounds frequently come in contact with the measuring instrument. Secondly, the instrument output is also affected by a number of factors such as environmental and human errors. Although measuring instruments and devices are protected against these factors, but still this can affect the measuring instrument's performance. Calibration helps in detecting faulty instruments, which are difficult to detect in normal working process. Some factors have temporary effects on the instrument performance, which can be easily corrected by simple adjustments. Whatever the case may be, or the scale of uncertainties, calibration helps to detect the faulty instrument. Calibration frequency Calibration frequency is defined as the interval after which calibration is performed or becomes necessary. It is necessary to perform calibration at regular intervals rather than following a random schedule. Otherwise, calibration will not be effective. If a regular schedule is not followed, chances are that the instrument can become faulty and its fault cannot be detected or traced. Calibration at regular interval is also a regulatory requirement. A pharma manufacturer can get a warning if appropriate frequency is not followed. Commonly, there are three frequencies followed in a pharma industry, monthly, quarterly, and yearly. Monthly means to calibrate the instrument every month. Quarterly means to calibrate the instrument after every three months. And yearly means to calibrate every year. There are different criteria for setting the calibration frequency to monthly, quarterly, and yearly. Some factors that determine the calibration frequency include Manufacturer's recommendation. It means setting the frequency of calibration according to the guidelines of the instrument manufacturer. The manufacturer provides various options for selecting the frequency calibration. It can be found in the maintenance or troubleshooting manual of an instrument. Instrument's usage. It means to select the instrument calibration according to its usage. If an instrument is frequently used in a pharma process, it can be calibrated more frequently. On the other hand, if an instrument is less frequently used, its calibration frequency can be less. New installation. Whenever an instrument has been installed for the first time, it must be calibrated. It will, it will help to detect any fault instrument, which can sometimes be difficult to detect because of its newly... Sometimes a newly installed instrument requires minor adjustment, which is normal and becomes necessary. Operating environment. Operating environment is a critical factor in determining the calibration because like all other industries, there are different environmental conditions at different locations. For example, at the technical floor, instrument installed can be subject to high temperatures, dust particles, and humidity as compared to instrument installed in the production floor. So in order to keep the instrument installed at this location accurate, calibration frequency is selected by considering the environmental conditions. Now let's discuss what are the standards for calibration by ISO or International Organization for Standardization. There are various standardization bodies for calibration. The International Organization for Standardization develops standards for various processes including the calibration. For calibration, the Clause 7.1.5 of ISO 9001-2015, known as Monitoring and Measuring Resources, defines the requirement for calibration. 
This clause deter this clause determines various requirement for a man for a manufacturer to fulfill. After fulfilling these requirements, the requirement for ISO are completed. and pharma manufacturer is said to be iso accredited in terms of calibration according to the clause 7.1.5 requirements of calibration are always calibrate instruments and devices from iso certified labs always perform calibration before using newly installed instrument for the first time calibration frequency must be properly defined proper record and documentation should be made in the last we will discuss what is a pharma calibrator and what is what is its importance in calibration in a pharma industry pharma calibrator is a device used to calibrate other devices also called master instrument it stimulates simulates real time conditions to be applied to instrument Pharma calibrator must be period, period, periodically checked from externally recognized laboratories. For every physical variable, different calibrators are used. Thank you for watching. I hope you really enjoyed this video. Please subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon so that you immediately know whenever there is a new video. You can also read this article on Pharma Specs website. Link of the article is also mentioned in the description.